Hi, welcome to another video for MRCS exam. Here are the question. An 18 years old man is undergoing an orchidectomy via escrotal approach. The surgeon mobilizes the spermatic cord from which of the following the outermost layer of this structure is derived. So here we can see the main points here. What is the outermost layer of the structure? Derivatives. Here the options. Options are internal oblique aponeurosis, external oblique aponeurosis, transversalis fascia, rectus sheet and camper fascia. So let's see here we can see the different layers of the scrotum. Here, first of all, we can see the skin, then this is the external oblique aponeurosis, then we can see the internal oblique muscles, then this, this is the transversalis abdominis muscle, then we can see this parietal layer of the tunica vaginalis and the visceral layer of the tunica vaginalis. So, this is the layers of this scrotum. And we can see after the skin, the first structure is the external oblique muscle. So, skin, external oblique muscle, internal oblique muscle, transversus abdominis muscle, parietal layer of the tunica vaginalis, then visceral layer of the tunica vaginalis. Then we can see the immediate underlying the skin. This is the external oblique muscle part, and this is the external spermatic fascia so this external spermatic fascia it is the first structure and it arises from the external oblique muscle here one of the important uh, we can see this is the governiculum and this governiculum is responsible for descent of the testis so in the second picture here we can see this is the layers of the scrotum first of all skin then external spermatic fascia and this external spermatic fascia it arises from the aponeurosis of the external oblique muscle so our final answer the most outer layer outermost layer of the structure this is the external oblique muscle 